Greetings everybody, this is Dave Matuzic, and I'm going to show you a quick tip for cutting a very accurate shoulder cut. In this case I'm cutting a tenon, but I'm going to use this in the building a five board bench workshop so we get a nice clean cut in one of our corners here. And I've actually laid out this uh, with a tool called a marking gauge. And I actually use two marking gauges uh, to lay out this tenon and it leaves a little knife line. And what I did is I just actually drew a pencil line right here so you might be able to see what I'm doing a little bit better. And let me zoom in a little bit here. And what I'm gonna do to get a nice shoulder for my saw to start in is I'm just gonna take a chisel and put it right in that knife line. Hold my chisel up straight and I'm gonna just push down. Not too hard, not too deep. I'm gonna come in and make what's called a paring cut. and just come down again and just take out that little chunk of material and because I have a nice straight up and down area there for my saw to start in my saw will start and it'll be a straight cut and it'll be right up against that knife line There's a quick, simple technique in order to cut out a nice, sharp tenon area with a saw. And even if you're not real into hand tools, this is, sometimes it's quicker to use a hand tool. It's just as accurate if you take your time and you lay out everything just right. Or if you had to make 100 tenons, you'd probably want to use your table saw. This is a quick way to get started in woodworking if you don't have those tools yet. So I just want to show this technique to you guys and hopefully... All of you have a great day. Thank you for watching.